All right. There Vivi versus Pecco. Nice little fist bump there. Get a load of this. Hero versus Diddy. Three, two, one, go! Oh, fantastic music choice here. King of Fighters, always with the bangers. I thought this was a Mega Man remix. It sounds very close to it. All right, Pecco coming out strong here with Diddy. Combo after combo. VV does have the magic. Is charging up some resources. But Hero Sword is just a lot slower than Diddy's options here. But Oomph is on board. Really just needs one hit to start bringing it back. Pecco absolutely untouched until now. What? Pecco just falling into it, shaking his head, being like, I... I could have avoided that. Bounce on board. Now Diddy's game plan is to have that banana on at all times, and you have to play around with it. But, with bounce there, it is going to get rid of that option for quite a while. Vivi just shaking his head at that. Pecco takes the first duck, I guess. <laughs> right? Didn't even look like it was going to kill, but hey. All right, Pecco taking, his, taking advantage. Trying to get as much damage on the board. All right, Oomph is on board. Pekka being like, get this out of here. All right, using that Oomph instead for a get up attack. Another one? I don't know what it is with VV and those Oomphs, but he's just been, they've just been getting those left and right. Like yesterday at Waypoint, it was just like Oomph after Oomph after Oomph. All right, no conversion off the banana. All right, both just spacing out. All right, Fireball, bounce. All right, the Banana Peel is going to be thwarted just for a little bit. The Pekko finally going down to a forward air. An offstage situation, though. BB at 128, another bounce. Pekko trying to close out the stock and show that they don't need, they don't need their Banana to win games. Of Sizzle, a very fast option. Can't kill, but it does scare. Monkey flip into the face. Ooh. I see what Pego is trying to do there. Trying to do the very sneaky up the explosion there. Bounce once more. Instead of using a VV, instead trying to rack up some MP there. Down to 12. Maybe a 170, an up tilt, a back air, any forward tilt could kill. Okay, what's going on over here? Oh, that looks like Vivi taking the second stock here. Accelerates. Now just trying to play the waiting game. Racking up that MP at the same time. Oh, I respect <gasps> that. I respect wow. that attempt. Wow. Well, who knew that they were going to shield that? Back here. Uh oh. Up tilt. Alright, down air trying to get back. Sometimes it's a good option if you're not expecting it. No thwack. Up tilt. <laughs> there we go. Alright, bounce is back. Accelerate, making them one of the fastest characters in the game. Accelerate! Wait, what? Was that sizzle? Okay, so. <laughs> Can we uh, get a replay of that? Uh, we will get a replay right now. Thank you. VB <laughs> taking <laughs> the <laughs> first game. Okay, so. Heroes have successfully gaslit people into thinking that... Oh, kaboom! They have a 100% chance of pulling kaboom on their respawn. <laughs> oh, it's so I don't believe that. I believe that Vivi's hero has a 100% chance of pulling kaboom. Every hero player is just a little bit different. Just like a snowflake. It's actually kind of insane. And we're on to the second game here. Often to go to Kalos as a counter pick. I can see this. There is a wall jump for Diddy. I mean, I guess. There's landing traps for you, but Hero is pretty good with landing traps too. You're trying to land suddenly a kaboom or a sizzle or a frizz or a ka frizz or a ka sizzle or a. <laughs> or a kaboom. Or, or a ka zap. What about Just a thwack? Is launched in your face. Hero is probably one of the best landing trappers in the game. On top of all that, they have uh, pivot F tilts. Uh -oh. Which just kind of muscle through your aerials sometimes. And jab, which is pretty decent at an anti-air. Oh, God. 
No wonder they're a hero. Alright, Peko waiting very patiently. Try not to get caught by that lightning. Accelerattled. <laughs> Both catching their projectiles. Peko avoiding that sizzle. Accelerattle and oof. Oh no, just the oof. 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 Alright. Wow. I love that. Actually That's right. killing? More Psych Up. Alright. Back air is still pretty Kaboom. good. <laughs> yeah. Kaboom. I'm not... I'm unsure if Peko was reading the menu or not, but... Yeah. No, I think he was just trying to make it back. Alright, Monkey Gotta foot. read that menu. Yes. If you're recovering, you have to notice if Kaboom is written there. Smashers can't read. Man, I'd read it. Just <laughs> it's a struggle, okay? Oh, God. Up oh. That right. combo is tilting. The hero swoosh into up tilt and... Is that going to have enough? No. All right. Unfortunately, Paco not being able to convert that down air into a stock. Instead of opting just roll in. Oh, Vivi accidentally picked up the banana. I am led uh -oh. to believe that they tried to uh, do a tilt. Yes, But if you do see stick tilt next to an item, you just pick up the item. Oh. And Vivi struggling to get back here, but the zoom... So they decide, forget... Oh! Could have read that. Well, it's very hard. You can actually land in three places. The left, the center, or the right. Yes, yeah, so Vivi decides forget disadvantage. Zoom. <gasps> Peckle! Wow. <laughs> Rare <laughs> black moments. Never feels good to be hit by that. I am once again asking you to read the menu. <laughs> <laughs> it's a lot to ask. All right, another zoom. Paco said, I did read the menu. I would like one of everything, please. <laughs> now I'm trying to read the menu. My eyes instinctively like go over there all the time. Just right. because I fight Vivi so often. Nah, that's fair. Okay. This is the oh. oh, they are out of mana and ouch. Vivi was predicting a uh, landing trap there and respawn kaboom. Quite unfortunate, but 100%. this is Paco's opportunity to bring this back. 60% of the time, it works every time. <laughs> I like those odds. Oh, big damage. Hero takes more damage and oof. Alright, another zoom. Instead of Deco opting to wait just to see where they land. Alright. No hoo-ha. <gasps> wow, actually predicting that up be there. Great parry. Getting their banana peel back. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Oh, oh! Yeah, I saw that bounce. Another zoom. Off to the wait again, one more time. Oh! Four tilt. He didn't believe in the banana hitting, so he didn't have forward smash ready to go. Fortunately not. Trying to catch anything, but an up air isn't going to take a dozen kill in this game. That's, the, that's a big thing about combos. Sometimes you just got to believe. Chat, give them all your oh, strength. Oh, oh. Peko takes game two. A great up smash. I Sometimes people will fall out of it, but it didn't happen that time. I did not reset the board. Here you go. Thank you. Thank you. Well, it's too late now. He was like, oh, the board isn't working. Time to just talk to Vivi, and now he's never going to look at it again. Well, it looks like we are going to go to Smashville? No. Yes, we are going to go to Smashville. If I read that in time. Oh, Vivi actually opting to go Lucario instead oh, yeah. of Hero. Okay. All right. Not their main anymore. Oh. But it does come out because hey, often oh, no. enough, exactly. They are go they are going back to Kalos. Lucario is still a character that Vivi is willing to trust. Set point to. <laughs> so why do you think uh, Vivi would go back to Kalos in this situation? Well, Lucario has great survivability on Kalos. That's kind of an important factor here. Ah, like. We've got big blast zones. Like, the side blast zones are the same, but the top blast zones are bigger, which means Lucario gets to live longer against Diddy and his 5,000 up smash confirms. <laughs> he gets to tech Diddy down air confirms at the ledge. Uh, they get to. And they get a wall to wall cling on, of all things. Ah. All right, so this is a good stage for both. And that was a weird air dodge. Hey, if you don't get caught, it works. All right, trying to go for that instant down or out of shield. And as someone who plays Wii Fit, this is something I know well about. Aura Sphere. Since Banana is transcendent, Aura Sphere will just go through Banana. Uh-oh. Ooh, caught that roll. Power. 
I need more, more power. All right, nice wall click. No, no, yeah. what a pick! What a pick! You can't do that, B. That was so slimy. I tried to go for it again. No. Oh, this is a problem. This is oh, a problem. That geez. that would have killed. <laughs> that legitimately would have killed. Yeah. I mean, he does get more power the stronger he is. Oh, jeez. Oh, not like this. Not like this. He has a kill range, especially with rage and aura. This is, yup. This is the other thing about Diddy. If you're playing properly defensively with lots of shields and not letting yourself get. Oh, <laughs> you know, um, he didn't need that. Good soggy. job, Pekko. <laughs> if you're playing properly again defensively against Diddy Kong, you're not going to find a lot of openings, but it's so hard for Diddy to kill you sometimes if you just give him grabs and nothing else, even with Monkey Flip. Because Monkey Flip doesn't kill that hard. Right. It's just annoying to deal with. Yeah, but if the point is hold on to the lead, then it's hard for Diddy. Because mm -hmm. he can't get his uh, he can't get his down tilt and up smash. He can't get raw up smashes. He can't get banana. All he's got are his throws and Monkey Flip. Vivi just doing a fantastic job of keeping Pekko out. Reading all of these rolls, getting these grabs. Pekko finally getting a grab of his own, trying to convert here. Trying to get at least one stock off that is actually his. I can definitely imagine this. This is mostly a response to Chap. I can definitely imagine this being a positive matchup for Lucario. It's looking like it. Pekko avoiding that Aura Sphere. One of Lucario's very good meta-relevant matchups. Ooh. Alright, Pekko avoiding getting caught in that. Not rolling, but that <laughs> oh back air caught on the platform. And Vivi takes a 2-1 after switching from Hero. Bro! What happened? What happened? It just looked like a complete reversal. Did that miss? Hold on. Frame by frame here, baby. Huh? Oh. Uh, no, I was getting to the next thing. I didn't uh, need to pause. Oh, okay. I was trying to get I, to this nonsense. Oh, right. Aha, uh -huh, he's going to there. jump. <laughs> nope. Ugh. I think he's also trying to like tilt it downwards, because you can't do that. Yes, maybe. Yeah, but angling tilts is hard. It is really hard, as we saw there. Even the best players will mess it up now and then. Also, I did not know this was a... Th okay, Peko did act, which means it wasn't completely true, but it was true enough. Yeah, it's true enough to get a kill. Jesus. Oh, we, did, we didn't get a clip of that uh, SD. Oh, yeah, I got that. Oh, yes. Why do you want the SD? It was funny. Bruh. Do you think that was a misinput? Okay, so what I think Vivi did there, the Nair wasn't a misinput, but... No, no, the, uh, the counter. I want to look at this again. Right. Okay, so they did up B. That's why they didn't have another up B. Uh, so the counter was definitely a mis... Well, maybe the counter wasn't a misinput. It's hard to say, but it probably was. That was probably going to be something like jump back onto the stage with Aura Sphere Charge. Yeah. I mean, that happens. It's fine. As I said...